was just about to take some fruit to my neighbors. We can help! Great! We have to fill these fruit baskets first. Whoa! Hey! Cece, put that back. This is my pet tree kangaroo. She'll do anything for bananas. Who doesn't love bananas? Hey! <laughs> Whoa, Cece! Silly Cece, we need to save those for everyone else. Do you want something to play with? I like to play. Now, Cece, you stay here while we deliver this fruit. Ready, everybody? Let's go! <laughs> Going up. Cece, I told you to stay behind. She's been following us the whole time. Oh, Cece. <coughs> oh, hello there. I'm Squidgy. Hello there. I'm Squidgy. Oh, Olive, her name is Squidgy, too. That's Jaja, Squidgy. She likes to repeat things. <coughs> repeat things. <coughs> Hey, look at that! Ah! Sprinkling! <laughs> the sprinklers lost its sprinkle. <laughs> Thirsty, birdie! Oh no! The water always flows in my garden. Why did it stop? We'd better find out what happened to the water. Listen! There's still some water dripping here. It must be coming from up there. This way, guys. Let's follow those drips to find the water. Come on, Jaja! Ah, come on, Jaja! There's a pond just up ahead. Yay! Hey, Jaja, race ya! Get it, boy! You still working on that puzzle, Justin? It's bedtime. I know, but I'm almost finished. Can I stay up just a little bit longer? Okay, you have five more minutes. Then get your PJs on. Wow, you're almost finished. What is it? It's a... It's a... Justin? <laughs> Justin! Uh -huh. I'm awake. Ooh, you must be tired. Maybe you need some fresh air. Good idea, Squidgy. It'll help us stay awake to finish this puzzle. Oh, oh, I'll get the window. Whoa! Brrr, it's cold. Yeah, Squidgy. We'll have no problem staying awake now. Hey, these look like doggies. You're right, Squidgy. It's a dog sled. Wouldn't it be great to ride a sled pulled by dogs? That would be awesome! Squidgy, we're on a dog sled. Hi, guys. Olive! Olive. Welcome to Alaska, the land of snow. Wow. wow! Up here, we use dog sleds to get around. Meet Kaya <coughs> and Mikmuk. <coughs> sled dogs ever. Mush, mush. Mush? It's a special dog sledding word. It means go fast. Ooh! Kaya! Mick Mook! Mush! Mush! <laughs> Can we do it again? <laughs> Not 
now, Squidgy. We've got to find Lucky. There sure are a lot of tunnels. He could have gone down any one of them. I'll look for more paw prints. And I'll try hollering some more. Yoo-hoo, Lucky! <laughs> he's that way. No, he's that way. That barking could have come from anywhere. Hmm. Look! Somebody's been digging a hole! <gasps> That's one of Lucky's holes for sure! Look! Here's another hole! <sighs> and another! So, where's Lucky? <gasps> Lucky! There you are, boy! You really had us worried. Hi, Lucky. Come on, Lucky. Time to go home. <laughs> Hold up, folks. Looks like Lucky's found something. He's found something in that hole. Gold! Lucky found gold! Lucky is the luckiest golden retriever ever! <laughs> uh, Thanks for helping me find Lucky. I don't know how we got out of my yard. Oh. I think I know. Yukon Don, I'm really sorry, but... I opened your gate to get my pan. You did? Yeah, and I guess I didn't close it all the way. Huh. Well, y'all admitted your mistake and everything turned out fine. Just next time, be sure to follow the prospector's golden rule. Always ask permission. You got it. Now you're a real prospector and a good neighbor to boot. Justin! We gotta go. Bye, Olive. Bye, you can done. Bye, Lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. So long, neighbors. See you. Are we going to go in? We can't, Squidgy. We need to always ask permission. Excuse me, Mr. Manning? Hey, is that you, Justin? My super saucer flew over to your backyard. May I please come and get it? Why, sure you can. Thanks for asking first. Got it. Thanks, Mr. Manning. Thanks, Justin. Go long! <laughs> that is the most super humongous horn I've ever seen. And it's a really, really big horn. I use it to call my goats home. I'm a goat herder. Meet Heidi, <laughs> Olaf, Ludwig, Hansel, and Gretel. Uh, Gretel? Gretel! 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 That's her! Whoa! That's a really, really high mountain! She's climbed the Zugspitze. The what? The tallest mountain in Germany. Then we'll just climb up after her. Come on, Olive. Olive? What's wrong? I've never climbed that mountain before. It's really high. It's okay, Olive. I'm an expert climber. I'll help you go get Gretel. Um, I want to help Gretel too, but that mountain's really, really big. And I'm really, really small. Hey, Squidgy, I need some help with my mountain climbing gear. Why don't you climb into my backpack? Really? Okay. Whenever you need something, just ask. Thanks, Squidgy. So, Olive, are you ready to climb that mountain? I do need to get Gretel back home before it gets dark. <laughs> A go herder takes care of her goats. I'm ready, Justin. All right. Let's go get Gretel! Uncle Anton! Hey, hey! I 
I'd like you to meet my good friends, Justin and Squidgy. Hi. Bonjour, Justin and Squidgy. Y'all must be here for the Fay Dodo. What's a Fay Dodo? Why, a Fay Dodo is a Louisiana dance party. And all my friends are coming over for some of my world famous gumbo stew. That's not ready yet. Not till the sun goes down. That's when the party really starts. Wow, a real alligator. Yep, that's my good friend Jumbo. And he sure loves my gumbo. He can smell it cooking from clear across the bayou. He sure can. And I can't hardly wait until the sun goes down. And I can try some of that gumbo at the Fay Dodo. <laughs> wait till you see them fireflies show up to light up the night. Oh, pack my crawdaddy cakes. I was so busy making my gumbo, I forgot to go to Firefly Island and invite the fireflies. Maybe we could go to Firefly Island for you, Uncle Anton. Why, sure. I'd appreciate that very much. Why don't y'all take my boat? Can we? Woohoo! Oh, fiddlesticks. I forgot my firefly basket. I'll be right back. Now the bayou has lots of twists and turns. It's real easy to get yourself lost. Don't worry, Uncle Anton. I'll get us there. Just the same, maybe I'll send Jumbo along to keep you safe. <laughs> you never know. Oh, did you hear that, Jumbo? We're going for a ride. First, you go way down the bayou. And when it starts to go this way or that, look for the rock with a green old mossy face. <laughs> that old mossy face always makes me laugh. I don't know why, it just does. Green mossy face. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Hi, Squidgy. When you hear the singing froggies, you're almost there. Froggy singing, right. Now on your way back, you won't be seeing that mossy rock. On account it's the only mossy on one side, mostly because the rain only comes from that side of the mossy rock. You understand? Um, rainy moss. Oh, now hold on, Jumbo. The boat's over there. You got to pay attention real close now. You gotta look for the white flower tree. Oh, that's so much better. I didn't bring my swimsuit. <laughs> Did you get that, Justin? Huh? Oh, yeah. Flower tree. I love flowers. Got it. I'm ready. Did Uncle Anton give you directions, Justin? Yep. <laughs> I know this old bio like the back of my hand. Y'all go fetch me those fireflies, and we'll have ourselves the best fado do in all of Louisiana. Aye! Why does he keep going aye? That just means he's happy. We do that here in Louisiana. Well, I'm happy too. Aye! 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 Ready for takeoff, Commander Justin? Roger that, Squidgy. But why is it so tiny? <laughs> That's a real plane, Squidgy. It's really high up in the sky. Wow! Wouldn't it be great if we could fly in a real plane? Yeah! Hey! Someone just jumped out! Justin. Hi, Squidgy. Olive! <laughs> Welcome to Africa! Wow! This is my ranger station. My job is to rescue animals in trouble. This is my puppet theater, and that's where I keep my puppets. Cool! A puppet chest. <gasps> Aw, look at this little bunny. I like this bird. Wee, fluttery butterfly. <laughs>
Hippity hoppity, hippity hoppity, hippity hop. Hello, Mr. Butterfly. Hello, Squeaky. Nice to see you. <gasps> oh, hello, Mr. Monkey. <laughs> huh? Squidgy, you found my friend Buddy. He loves my puppets. Maybe he'd like to watch our show. What do you think, Buddy? <laughs> oh, he said yes. <laughs> you want to try my butterfly puppet? <laughs> okay. You just hold it like this, and you move it up and down. Here. Right. Now you move it up and down. That's it. You're getting it. Um, Squidgy. <laughs> Careful with that, buddy. <laughs> Uh-oh. Olive, buddy broke the butterfly. No problem, Squidgy. I can fix that. Can you please hand me that stick, buddy? <laughs> Thanks. There you go, buddy. Good as... Hey, where'd Buddy go? <laughs> <laughs> Buddy, what are you doing in the puppet chest? <laughs> oh, I know. Puppets sure are fun. <laughs> Buddy says he really wants to play with the puppets. Sorry, those puppets break very easily. Mm -hmm. Why don't we play something else? Good idea. Hey, everybody! I found Princess Fifi! Yay! We, we did, did it. it! Wait a minute. How are we going to get her down? Oh, I can just carry her. You can? Sure. Meet Princess Fifi! Princess Fifi is a kitty cat! <laughs> <laughs> Wow, I thought we were looking for a real princess. <laughs> I'm glad she's safe, but I wonder where that beast is. <gasps> B beast? Oh, you little beast. Why must you always chase Princess Fifi around, huh? The beast? <coughs> is it a puppy? Oh, Princess Fifi, there you are. <gasps> Bonjour, bonjour! Anyone for cookies? <gasps> <laughs> Princess Fifi, how about some more cookie royale? Huh? Oh, I want peanut butter! Chocolate chunk for me! Oh, oh, I'll have lemon drop, and oatmeal raisin, and chocolate chip, and uh, do you have any white chocolate macadamia nut? <laughs> Oh, thank you, my royal musketeers. You found my little princess. It's so funny. We thought that Princess Fifi was a real princess, not a cat. Yeah, and the beast turned out to be a cute little puppy. <laughs> I mean, who knew? I guess things aren't always what they seem at first. We would have never figured it out if we didn't work together. All for one, and one for all! Justin! There's my mom. I'd better go. Merci, Justin. No problem, Your Highness. We were happy to rescue the princess. Bye! Bye! Goodbye! Bye-bye, salut, adieu! Bye, everyone! Mom! Dad, wait! You can't! You can't what, son? You can't put Moo Moo Bear in the charity box. Moo Moo Bear in the charity box? We'd never do that. No, but we would put him in the laundry. He needs a wash. Hmm, Moo Moo, you didn't need to be rescued after all. Ow! Hello, Chief. We're here. Hi. You've brought the totem box. Chief, uh, there's something we should tell you. I see the box is empty. There are no gifts. There was a poor bear. Uh, we met this really cute sea otter. Um, well, there was a family of ravens, and... I guess what we were trying to say is... We gave everything away. <laughs> That's wonderful. Huh? huh? But 
Didn't you say those gifts were important? Yes. And the feeling you get when you share with others is the greatest gift of all. You know what? It did feel good to share those gifts. The ravens were so grateful. And the sea otter loved his rattle. And the bill looked marvelous. Well, that deserves an ow! Ow! Now come with me. I have a surprise for you. Hey, look! Everyone's here! Your friends have all come to thank you and to help us unwrap our new totem pole. Awesome! Everyone, please take a rope. Now pull! <laughs> wow! Hey, look! It's a wolf! And a raven! Oh, and a sea otter! And there's a bear! And don't forget Olive, Squidgy, and Justin. Ow! Oh. 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 Justin! That's my dad. I'd better go. Bye, everybody! Bye! Bye! Goodbye, Justin. Goodbye, Squidgy. Ow! So, Justin, what are you gonna do about Tiny? Tiny, I know you're gonna make some little kid really, really happy. So, into the charity box you go. Bye, Tiny. Don't lose that squeak. Dad, our charity box is ready to go. A call! San Francisco Fire Station. We'll be right there. Come on, someone needs our help. We'll take the fastest way down. A fire pole! Whee! 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 <laughs> I'll drive. I'll ride on the back. I'll crank the siren! Good and loud, Squidgy. <laughs> up. I know. We can fill up the pond with the fire hose. Good idea, Justin. Don't worry. We'll save your ducklings. Squidgy, no! at the pond. Good rescue, team. Yep, those are some lucky duckies. That was fun, but it wasn't a really big rescue. <laughs> let's get back to the station and see if we get any more calls for help. Yeah, let's go! <laughs> Bye-bye, Ducky! We're here! And we finished our first task. On our quest to find... The Golden Yarn! Greetings, friends! It is time for your second task. Come, we go! Your second task tests how fast you are and how smart you are. I'll do it, Nick. I'm very fast. And very smart. <laughs> Excellent. I will summon my friend Milos. <laughs> Aw, a baby wild boar. Aw, he's so cute. 
Milos loves to be chased, so Justin, your task is to catch him. Are you ready? Ready, ready, ready. Begin! <laughs> Justin, you're cracking me up. This pig catching task is hard. Use your head, not your feet, my little friend. You can do it, Justin. Yeah, you can do it, Justin. Use my head? Hmm. I've got it. Gotcha. <laughs> well done, Justin. You did it. One more task for you. Come with me, my friends. Yep, we're stuck. What are we going to do about our delivery? You mean, your friends won't get their warm blankies? Hmm. If only we had something we could break the ice with. The narwhal! Squidgy, I think he wants to help us. Ooh. Oh, okay. Where'd he go? I don't know, but he said to wait here. He's taking a long time. Whoa! Whoa go, Mr. Narwhal! What's he doing? He's breaking the ice. He must be making a path for us. Justin. Now my friends will be warm and toasty. We couldn't have done it without Mr. Narwhal. Thanks, Mr. Narwhal. <coughs> Mr. Narwhal is saying thank you for helping him with the seaweed. You're welcome, Mr. Narwhal. And thank you for helping us through the ice. Without you, we wouldn't have made it through the Northwest Passage. Or deliver these warm blankies. <coughs> <laughs> Justin! Oh, that's Dad calling. Time to go. Okay, guys. Thanks for your help. Bye, Bye Olive! Bye, Bye Mr. Mr. Narwhal! Sure, I'd love some, Justin. You helped me get unstuck, Dad. Now it's my turn to help you. Oh! We're, we're shoveling, shoveling up the snow. We're shoveling up the snow. There's lots of snow, so here we go. We're shoveling up the snow. Wow, what's that? It's Annie Nookshuk, a statue made of rocks. See how one side is longer than the other? It shows us which way to go. Olive. Is that you? A took! Justin, Squidgy, meet my friend a took. Hi! Hello. How's it going, little dudes? So, what are you up to, a took? Oh, you know, just chilling, being an artist, and building the biggest Anookshuk ever. The biggest? Yeah, that's right. The biggest. Ever? Ever. Can we help? 
<laughs> awesome. Give me some mint. Frosty. Frosty. <laughs> All right, so check this out. I've got the very last slab of rock to finish my biggest Danook shook ever. How are you going to move that? We can take it on my dog sled. Dudes, that is awesome. That's it. Keep it coming. Put it down. Uh, okay. We're all set. Do you want to drive, Justin? Do I? You bet. So, where are we going, Atuk? My favorite place. All you gotta do is follow the Anukshuks. Right. Follow the Anukshuks. I'll keep an eye out for them. Squidgy, you can sit with me and be the musher. I get to be the musher! Ready to mush mush? Do you want to ride with us? Thanks, dudes. But I'm gonna take some shortcuts through the deep snow. Are you sure? Our dog sled's pretty fast. Oh, don't worry. I've got these snowshoes. I'm a really fast runner. Watch this! Wow, that is fast! So meet you at the first Anukshuk, okay? Sounds good. See you later, Atuk. Mush! Mush! Oh, yeah. hey! <laughs> Stay frosty! This must be what Uncle Anton meant when he said the bayou goes this way and that. So, do we go this way or that way? Or this way? Uncle Anton said to look for the rock with a mossy face. Hmm, mossy face, huh? Okay. <gasps> hey, do I know you? <laughs> That's the rock with the mossy face. And it looks just like you. Hi there, good looking. Firefly Island, here we come. Justin, are you sure we're still going the right way? Hey, what's that sound? <gasps> it's the singing frogs. We're almost there. Firefly Island. Oh, hi. I'm Squidgy. This is Clovis, and she says welcome to Firefly Island. Clovis, Uncle Anton sent us to invite you and your friends to his Fado Do. Wanna come? She says she'd love to come. Here, you can ride in my basket. Now let's get back to Anton's party before the sun goes down. Aye! Aye! Hey, froggies. Want to come to our Fado Do? Hop on. Aye! Here's where everything goes this way and that way, just like Uncle Anton said. Let me think. On the way to Firefly Island, he said, Watch for the rock with a mossy face. Uh-huh, I remember that. But on the way back, Anton said watch for the flower tree. But all the trees have flowers. What color flowers, Justin? Um, he said, uh, I guess I wasn't really listening to that part. Well, the sun is going down, and Uncle Anton needs these fireflies. And Jumbo needs some gumbo. <laughs> Squidgy, that's it. Uncle Anton said Jumbo can smell gumbo cooking from clear across the bayou. Do you smell the gumbo, Jumbo? <laughs> okay, Jumbo, go get that gumbo. <laughs> hey, white flowers. I was wondering when y'all would show up. <laughs> My gumbo's ready to eat. Sure smells yummy. <laughs> Sorry, we got a little lost, Uncle Anton. 
We found a mossy rock and the singing frogs, but then on the way back, we couldn't remember. Ah, you found a white flower tree. We had a little help from Jumbo. <laughs> well, I sure hope you brought me them fireflies. We sure enough did, Uncle Anton. Okay, fireflies, now's the time. Do your thing. A starry sky. Yep, that's real nice. Now, let's get this fado do started. Aye! <laughs> I'm thirsty, Squidgy. Can you please pass me some water? Uh, nope. No. Nope. Aha! Here you go. Thanks. Hey, Justin. Why do you need a hat and a scarf? It's summer. Here in the mountains, the higher up you go, the colder it gets. Do you see that white stuff up there? Yeah, what is that? It's snow, Squidgy. <gasps> snow day! We can go tobogganing, or we can make snow angels, oh, or a snowman. And we can eat snow cones. Oh, I love snow days! <laughs> Me too, Squidgy. But we've got a job to do. We've got to go get Gretel. Right. How are you doing, Olive? I'm okay. This isn't as hard as I thought. Are you doing okay, Squidgy? Yeah, it's really cozy in here. Woohoo! This is fun. Hey, wait up. Great, Olive. I still can't believe we've gone so far already. I knew you could do it. Now, are you ready for this? I'm not sure. It looks kind of impossible. Don't worry, Olive. I'll give you instructions. <laughs> hey, it's Gretel! Gretel's waiting for us, Olive. You can do this. You're right. I can do this. I need to get Gretel. I'm ready. Do you use airplanes to look for animals in trouble? Not just airplanes. The jungle is really big, so I need to use all kinds of vehicles to get around. Like my Jeep. Follow me. A, A Jeep? Jeep? Wow, I've always wanted to ride in a Jeep. Can we come rescue animals with you? Of course. <laughs> 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 Hello, Mr. Monkey. This is Kima. <laughs> he likes to visit me at the ranger station. Hi, Kima. We're gonna rescue some animals. Wanna come with us? <laughs> What's wrong, Kima? <laughs> <laughs> what? A baby giraffe? <laughs> In trouble? A baby giraffe needs our help. <laughs> and he's down at the river. I'll have a look. Well... There's the river, but I can't see anything. We're too far away. We need to get closer. Good idea, Justin. We'll use my Jeep. I'll drive. And I'll keep an eye out for the giraffe. I'll take care of Kima. To the rescue! Any giraffe. Okay, so where's the baby giraffe, Kima? <laughs> he doesn't remember this part of the river. Hmm, this jungle is so thick. I can't see the rest of the river from here. What do you think, Olive? Hang on. Hmm, the river's just too twisty. <laughs> he said he's going higher up the tree for a better look. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see anything, Kima? <laughs> no, he didn't see the giraffe. Well, we can't see the giraffe from here or my ranger station. 
Then we need to get even higher. If only we could fly, Justin. Squishy, that's it. We can fly. So what are these animals, Olive? A bear, a sea otter, and a raven. I've seen them on totem poles before. Hmm. I get it. We have to find totem poles with these animals on them. Hey! I see a bear pole! That's the first animal in the box. Cool. Let's go. There it is! Huh. I don't see any parties from here. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Whoa, uh. a real bear! It looks like she's really itchy. She has burrs stuck to her fur. Let's go help her. Hi there, Miss Bear. We can help you. <coughs> if you could just hold still for a sec. Ouch! These burrs are sharp. How can we get them off? <coughs> yeah, your fur could use a brushing. Too bad we don't have a brush. Wait a second. My comb! There we go. <coughs> wow! That comb really came in handy. I know. I just love it. I think the bear loves your comb, too. Here, why don't you keep it? Uh. That's so pretty. Oh, that's so you. <laughs> Olive, that comb was a gift to you. I know, but the bear needs it more than me. And besides, she's so happy. Uh. I know. I never know what to do with my hair, either. <laughs> Looking good, Miss Bear. Uh. She said you're looking good in that hat, Justin. Thanks. The wolf chief gave it to me. So what do you want to play? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Buddy wants to play tag. I guess I'm it, but not for long. Tag! Huh? You're it now, Olive! <laughs> 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 now I'm in. <laughs> Hurry! <laughs> what should we play next? How about Justin Says? Justin Says! I love Justin Says! It's the best game in the world! You do everything that Justin says. But only if I say Justin says. Justin says, hop up and down like a bunny. Boing, 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 boing. boing, boing. <laughs> I like carrots. Justin says, flap your wings like a birdie. <laughs> <laughs> now everybody go wild like a monkey. <laughs> <laughs> Buddy wins. I didn't say Justin says. Now, Justin says... Well, my tummy says it's snack time! Hey, where are you going, buddy? <coughs> Thanks, buddy. <laughs> huh? Looks like Buddy wants to play monkey in the middle. And I guess I'm the monkey. <laughs> Squidgy. Mm. Those were yummy bananas. Mm. It's starting to get late. It's almost time for the show. <laughs> hey, where are you going now, buddy? Aren't you coming to watch the puppet show? <laughs> oh, okay, well hurry back. The show's about to start. He says he has to go home, but he'll be back in time for the show. Um, Justin? What's wrong? How do I get around this overhang? I don't know what to do. Try stretching your arm straight above your head. There's a little crack above your hand. Use that to pull yourself up. Now see that rock next to your knee? 
reach around that rock with your foot. <sighs> I made it! Yay, Olive! I knew you could do it! All right, we're coming up now. <sighs> Whew, what a climb. We are so high up now. Brr, it's chilly up here. We need our winter gear, Squidgy. You got it. Hats and scarves for everyone. I feel toasty already. Gretel! How did she get way up there? Goats are good climbers, but I've never climbed anything like that before. It goes straight up. Hmm. I know just the thing. I'll lasso that rock up there. So close! Maybe try making the loop bigger. Good idea. Uh, this rope feels stuck on something. Justin, look behind you. There's nothing behind me. <laughs> huh? Hi, Justin! <laughs> Hi, Squidgy! Wait a minute. I know how we'll get Gretel. Okay. Pull! Don't worry, Gretel. We are coming to get you. Come here, Gretel. Come on. Olive, she won't come to me. Gretel's really shy with strangers. Sorry, Gretel. I don't want to scare you. <laughs> Lower me down, Olive. Olive, Gretel's too shy to let me get her down. You're the only one she trusts. But she's so high up. I don't know if I can do it. Olive, you thought climbing this mountain would be hard, but you got past those big rocks. Yeah, and it was fun too. And when we got to the tricky part, you thought you couldn't do it, but you did. I did do it, and it felt really good. Now we're so close to Gretel, and you're the only one who can get her down. I know, but that's really high, Justin. <laughs> but I'm a goat herder, and a goat herder takes care of her goats. Yeah! We can use my rescue plane. <gasps> Can you fly the plane, Justin? I can be the lookout. Sure, Olive. Let's go. Oh, <laughs> 
Oh, little dudes, you made it. Make yourself a chair. Rest a while. No thanks, Atuk. We're gonna keep going. Yeah, this is so much fun! <laughs> okay, you sure you're not tired? I'm okay. Anyone else tired? I'm fine. I'm a musher. Mush, mush! <gasps> <Whoa>! <laughs> Ooh, brain freeze. Do you see the next Anukshuk olive? There it is, down in the forest. Hit it, Squidge. Mush! Mush! Whee! <laughs> <laughs> oh, hi, Mikmok. Hi, Kaya. Need a lift? <laughs> Whoa, that was some radical sledding, little dudes. That was so much fun. How about a break? Remember, to do your best, you need your rest. Thanks, Atuk. We'll rest when we're tired, but we're okay for now. Right, Squidgy? <sighs> I'm a musher. <laughs> All right, you can rest when you get to my favorite place. It's just past this forest. Got it. And that's where we'll see the biggest Anukshik ever? Yup, little dude. You can't miss it. Ooh, I can hardly wait. All right, let's go. See you there, Atuk. Hit it, Squidge. Mush! Mush! <laughs> Bye! See you later. Alligators, frogs, and the fireflies, too. Woo! Oh, I love living on the old bayou. Oh, I love living on the old bayou. <laughs> Justin, time for your bath. Come on, Squidgy. Bye, Jumbo. See you later, alligator. <laughs> I've always wanted to say that to a real alligator. Bye, Olive. Bye, Uncle Anton. Bye, Bye Justin. Justin. Au revoir, Squidgy. Hey, Justin, we didn't find your squeaky alligator. I'll ask Mom again. Maybe I wasn't listening carefully before. Hey, Mom, did you say my alligator was in the back of the closet? No, honey, the bathroom closet. I put it there after your bath last night. Oh, the bathroom closet. Yay, Squidgy! I found it! Yay! I mean, aye! I almost forgot! The Wolf Chief's totem party! Let's check the box. We need to find the sea otter totem pool next. Oh, okay. She says it's just across the water and we can use that canoe. Awesome! Thanks, Thanks Miss Bear. Bear! Bye! <laughs> And that's a sea otter on the top. Hey, it is! What's a sea otter? Oh, Squidgy, they're super playful and so cute. And they love to play in the water. What was that? A baby sea otter! Oh, look at him! Hey, let's play together! Yeah! Oh, you want to try? Sure, here. Hey, another sea otter. That must be his mommy. <coughs> what? You've been looking all over for your baby? <coughs> oh, she found us because of all the rattling. Well, you better keep it. You're such a good rattler. Squidgy, that's so nice of you. But I thought you really liked that rattle. Yeah. But the baby really loves it, and he is so cute. And the mommy will always know where he is with that rattle. Bye! Bye. Ready? Ready. <laughs> You're almost there! Keep going, Olive! Silly 
Gretel. How did you get up here? Let's go home. I can't believe I climbed that mountain. I never thought I'd do that. And I couldn't have done it without your help and encouragement, Justin. Me neither. I've never climbed that high before. I knew you both could do it. Well, it's getting late. I better call my goats home. Oh, oh, can I blow this time? Go for it, Squidgy. <gasps> Goats are so happy now. Thanks, Squidgy. Thanks, Justin. I'm glad we got Gretel home safely. Justin! And now it's my turn to go home. Bye, Olive. Bye, Justin. Bye, Squidgy. Bye, Olive. Bye! So, Squidgy, do you want me to teach you how to climb? I think I'm ready now, Justin. Okay. Grab the blue bar and swing your legs over the green bar. Huh? Yeah. Then grab the yellow nub and pull yourself up. Uh. Look, Squidgy, you're doing it! <laughs> I am! I am! I'm climbing! We're kings of the mountain! Woohoo! <laughs> hey, you really can't see everything from up here, huh, Justin? Look, there's your house! And your school and the hockey rink. Oh, and the ice cream shop. <laughs> hey, guys, do you want to play a game while we wait for the next call? Sure, how about checkers? Checkers, I love checkers. I'm red. Okay, Squidgy, it's your move. Hmm. Another call. I bet this time it's a really big rescue. San Francisco Fire Station, we'll be right there. Let's go. Someone else needs our help. This is it, Squidgy. This one's a really big rescue. I can feel it. The biggest rescue ever. Little girl? Cuddles. Oh, I like cuddles too. <laughs> Squidgy, this is Susie. And Cuddles is Susie's cat. <coughs> oh, Cuddles. He's stuck in the tree. Cuddles. Don't worry, Susie. We'll get Cuddles down for you. He's pretty high up. We'll have to use the ladder. <coughs> Here, Cuddles. Come on, kitty. Ah. Cuddles? I need to be a little higher. Okay, hold on. How's that? A little higher. More? Perfect. Cuddles! Ah. 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 Cuddles is so cuddly. Good work, team. Yeah. Helping ducks and kittens is great, but I want to go on a big rescue and be a real hero. Sometimes it's a big rescue, sometimes it's a not-so-big rescue. Let's get back to the station. Bye, Susie. Bye, Cuddles. Bye. Thank you. <laughs> brought all your friends. <laughs> you know what this means. <laughs> it's showtime! Olive, you've closed the curtain. How will anybody see our puppets? They won't. What? Huh? Watch. <laughs> They'll see shadows of the puppets. <laughs> Once upon a time, there was a beautiful bird who loved to flitter about. <laughs> that looks amazing, Olive. How did you do it? Anything between the lantern and the screen will make a shadow. Oh, I get it. The birdie was flittering around one day 
when along came her best friend, the fluttery butterfly. <gasps> That's me! Ah, my puppet is gone! So is mine! <laughs> Ugh, we won't be able to finish our play. You mean, I won't be able to be a fluttery butterfly? <sighs> Wait, Squidgy, look! Hey, a butterfly! Wait a second. That's... that's me! I'm a butterfly! <laughs> You're making a shadow all by yourself, Squidgy. Maybe I can, too. With my hand. Great idea, Justin. Let's do it. Fluttery Butterfly saw his best friend, Bunny, who loved to play with Birdie, too. Oh. I like it. Let's keep going. So they all got together, Birdie flittered, <whistles> Butterfly fluttered, flutter, 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 and Bunny hopped all around. Hippity hoppity, hippity hoppity, hippity hoppity. <laughs> so they flittered and fluttered and hippity hopped until it was time to go to bed. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> Nice fluttering, buddy. <laughs> nice hopping, buddy. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> buddy brought back the puppets. That's so nice. He doesn't need them anymore. Look. <laughs> <laughs> Justin. I have to go. Bye, Olive. Bye, monkeys. <laughs> Bye, Olive. Bye, buddy. Bye, Justin. Bye, Squidgy. Thanks for helping me with the puppet show. I can't wait for tomorrow. We have so many games to play. Tag, Justin says, monkey in the middle. I know something we can play tonight. Whoa, shadows. Hippity hoppity, hippity hoppity. Flutter, flutter, flutter. <laughs> All right, where to next? The raven totem pole. It's the last one. Hmm. There it is, in the forest. Let's go. Wow. wow. These trees are ginormous. Even the crows are huge. <laughs> Those aren't crows, Squidgy. They're ravens. What? The ravens say their nest fell apart. Oh, no. That means they won't have a place to sleep tonight. We'll help you build a new nest. How, Justin? It'll take too long. That's a big pile of branches. Huh. I guess you're right. <coughs> hey, I know something that would work. <coughs> Your hat. That would make a perfect nest. But are you sure? Yeah, Justin, that hat was a gift. Yeah, but these ravens need it more than I do. They say thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> hey, that's the wolf chief. We are almost at the totem party. Sounds like he's over there. Let's go. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Giraffe, we're coming! How did you get there, anyway? He said he walked over some rocks, but now they're gone! <laughs> <laughs> hey, here's a rock! A um, moving rock? Moving rocks? I've never seen that before. Hmm, I wonder what's making them move. I'm going in for a closer look. <gasps> Squidgy, that's not a 
a rock, that's... <laughs> a hippo! Oh, hello, Mr. Hippo. <laughs> so the baby giraffe didn't walk across rocks. He walked across hippos. But there's only one hippo. Where are the others? I can't see any other hippos from here. We need to get higher up for a better look. Good idea, Justin. But how? Hmm. <laughs> hey, I think they want us to climb on. Perfect. Thank you, Mr. and Mrs. Giraffe. Wow, we can see everything from up here. Hi, Justin! Oh. Olive, look! There's something in the water. You're right. I think that's another hippo. And there's even more of them. <coughs> Squidgy, we need Mr. Hippo's help. Mr. Hippo, can you ask your friends to come out of the water? <laughs> Justin, look at those bubbles. The hippos are talking to each other. <laughs> look, Kima, we can get to the island now. <laughs> Going up. Yay! Oh, that's so cute. The baby is back with his mommy and daddy. Thanks for helping with the animal rescue. It was fun, Olive. Wasn't it cool the way we looked at things in different ways? Oh, yeah. We saw things from way up high when we were in Olive's plane. And then you found the hippos underwater. <laughs> Plus, we got a better look at the river thanks to Mr. and Mrs. Giraffe. <laughs> <laughs> Justin! That's my mom calling. We'd better get back. See you! Bye! Goodbye, Justin! Bye, Squidgy! Bye! We've got to find that plane, Squidgy. But, Justin, we looked everywhere. Down in the grass, in the flowers. Hmm. Wait a minute. I have an idea. Hmm. I just had to look for it in a different way. All right, Squidgy, I'm going to shake the branch. Ready? <gasps> yes! Yeah! We got Way it! Way to go! Yeah! Wait right here. I'll go get the controller. Ready for takeoff, Pilot Squidgy? Ready for action, Commander Justin. Snow and trees. Hmm. A took said it's just past this forest. So it can't be that much farther. I hope we get there soon. I'm getting a little tired. Ooh. Hmm. Not me. I'm not tired. <laughs> I'm not tired at all. Hmm. Can you smell that? Coco! Maybe it's coming from those igloos over there. What's an igloo? They're cozy little snow houses. <laughs> cozy snow house. <sighs> Olive, Squidgy's sleeping. Whoa, he's really snoring. Wait, that's not Squidgy snoring. It's coming from over there. Hey, those are a took snowshoes. And here's a note. Hey, little dudes. Sorry I couldn't wait up. 
I was way tired. I built an igloo for you guys. You know, in case you want to rest. It does look cozy. Aw, Micmuck and Kaya look cozy too. P.S. I left some hot cocoa in the igloo. You know, just in case. Signed, I took. Mm. Hot cocoa? That's right, Squidgy. We're at the igloos. <laughs> huh? Oh, we're here! Come on, let's go inside. Mm, hot cocoa. Sure is yummy. It's so warm and cozy in here. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Me too, Squidgy. Now let's find that Anookshook. Hey, what's that? It's the biggest Anookshook ever! Right on, little dudes. <laughs> you look rested. We feel great! How come we didn't see this last night? We must have been really tired. Like you said, it took. To do your best, you need your rest. And hot cocoa? Thanks for bringing me my rock. No problem, it took. Wait, how are we going to get it way up there? I have an idea. Everyone ready? Ready! Ready! Hit it, Squidge! Kaya, Mikmuk, mush! Mush! <laughs> This is the best Inuk Shook ever! Whoa! Justin! Time to go. Little dudes! Stay, Stay frosty! Bye, Atuk! Bye, Olive! <laughs> Bye, everyone! Bye! Bye! <laughs> Really? What is it? Watch. This piece goes here. Uh-huh. And that piece goes there. It does. And this piece goes... Right, right here. here! Look, Squidgy, it's... An, an Anookshook! 